So, you are wanting to go on the cruise, but the only hiccup is that you are a peritoneal dialysis or a hemodialysis patient. So, can you go on the cruise with a dialysis machine and some dialysis supplies? Why, well, yes, you can. I live with one. So, my wife is a um, she is a, a hemodialysis patient, so she does hemodialysis at home. And so you see we have um, Betty the cycler with us, who we named our cycler. <laughs> so <laughs> so um, we just wanted to come on and just talk about if you're a dialysis patient, can you do dialysis on the ship? And the answer to that is yes, you can. If you have a machine, you can carry your machine with you. You can get a bag from your dialysis center or you can purchase a bag from Next Stage mm -hmm. and you can carry your bag, your cycler with you. Um, just because you're on dialysis does not limit you to having a good vacation. So, uh, like we said, Betty goes with us everywhere we we go on vacation, uh -huh. and even out here in the ocean. The only thing is that you have to make sure that you are very well trained, which Sherrod is very well trained, oh, yeah. and you know everything that could happen, um, any possibilities, you have to get clearance from your nephrologist in your dialysis center um, and your cruise line will have to know that you are fit to sail. So yeah, so they send that letter, so you gotta get that letter. Mm -hmm. um, the, the doctor gotta fill out a fit to sail letter, right? You gotta turn it in, they gotta turn it in to the cruise line, but cruise you gotta line. get that filled out by your doctor. And it all has to be approved before you are approved to sail. Um, and if and if they don't have that letter, whether your cruise is paid for or not, if they don't have that letter, you will not get on that ship. Exactly. So just make sure that you are very well trained. I have been doing dialysis for six years now. I've done peritoneal dialysis, mm. and now I'm doing home hemodialysis. You can carry your peritoneal dialysis machine with you as well. Um, the first couple of cruises that we went on, um, I took my peritoneal machine. Um, even when uh, my daughter and I went on a graduation cruise, I took my machine with me. Sherrod did not go with us on that cruise, so I was able to do all of that by myself. So if you are trained on your machine and you feel good about it, you can go out here in this ocean and do your dialysis and enjoy your vacation. Because, I mean, I'm not restricted to just being at home. And that's the big picture message, y'all. Just because you're a dialysis patient does not mean that you cannot enjoy vacations, enjoy cruises, enjoy the final things. You just got to make sure you're prepared. A um, question came up from a fan that said, well... What happens about what happens if you what can you, what do you have to do in order to order your supplies so that way they make sure they get here on time? You have to call. You have to get your um, if you're doing home hemo, your dialysis center has to contact the travel uh, dialysis travel department and put in that order for you. You have to make sure you know what you're gonna need for your trip. We are on here for six days. Um, my treatment, I do five days um, with two days off. So I'm doing six days, but I'm still gonna do my two days off and we're gonna do a treatment once I get back home. But you have to get your dialysis center to order your supplies. Let them know exactly what you need. What I ordered was 12 cases of the fluid that we, I have to use and dialysis one, and one case of cartridges that I have to put in here. All of my other supplies I already had at home. I put them in a, a suitcase 
and I brought those with me. That thing was heavy, boy. You have to make sure that you have enough supplies with you that's going to carry out your whole entire um, trip. And make yourself a checklist to make sure that you have all of your, your supplies that go with you. We went on a vacation one time. I have to say this, honey. And this is our warmer for our dialysate. And we forgot the cord. Oh, yeah. We forgot the cord. I remember that. Wait a minute. Let me see if I can pull this out. This little cord right here. We forgot this cord. Ooh, Without this cord, this little device right here cannot heat up. Nope. And if you cannot heat up your dialysate, then that's going to mess with your body temperature. And those of you on dialysis, y'all know that. It's going to mess with your body temperature, and that's not fun. I had that issue one time, but it's only because my machine at home, the temperature had changed. But anyway, just to let you know, um, I am enjoying my vacation. Me, Betty, and Sherrod, you know, this is the only other woman I'm going to allow him to be around. <laughs> this is the only other woman that will be in close contact. So, me, Sherrod, and Betty are having a good vacation. And just know that, you know, like I said, you do not have to be confined to your home or depressed because you're on dialysis and you feel like you can't go anywhere. I mean, we have gone to Dallas, Texas. Ben has been to Dallas. We've gone to the beach. We've gone, mm -hmm. I mean, now we're down here in Florida, you know. Um, so we're off the coast of Florida now. We're heading well, to yeah. the Bahamas, you know. I mean, and even like for like Thanksgiving, you know, I go to my sister's. Mm -hmm. You can take your machine if you're going to be in a hotel Take your machine with you to the hotel, you know, you can set it up. I take my machine to my sister's house, you know, and you just find the time that you're going to do your treatment, do your treatment, and it's done, you know. Like, we did a treatment today, you know, and now I'm done. We get ready to head out, get dressed, head out to go to dinner, you know, yeah. and then enjoy a comedy show later. So, and then I guess the main thing is there are ships that have dialysis on board. So all you got to do is just um, contact the cruise line. I think Norwegian is a cruise line where they have dialysis on the ship. There is a Royal Caribbean ship that has dialysis on the ship. Um, they have a dialysis center. They have a dialysis center on the ship. It's called Dialysis at Sea. So that's a tip for you. Dialysis at Sea. So go ahead and make sure that you do your homework and your research. Dialysis at Sea. That's where you're going to find the information about cruise ships that have dialysis on them. But every single cruise ship that you can think of has where you can do dialysis in your stateroom. So just make sure you know and understand that just because you are on dialysis, that doesn't mean that you can't have a good time. If you have not already subscribed to our Facebook page, it is Follow Your Dreams and Travel. And also on Facebook, our page is Follow Your Dreams and Travel. And on YouTube, it is C Rod Travels. That is C E E R O D Travels. Love God, love family, love people. Peace. And say bye to Betty one more time. All right, Betty, we'll holler at you. <laughs>